Yo, it's your boy having a vegan here. I just wanted to make a video. I, I, I saw a clip from, from a podcast from a guy called Lex Friedman. He's a pretty interesting guy. He's from Russia, but he graduated and I think he got a master's in, in physics and he now specializes in um, AI and stuff. I actually read, started reading one of his papers and yeah, it's very interesting stuff. Obviously, it's physics and how learning, how AI learns and stuff. It's very complicated. I mean, it's very hard to read the paper from someone uh, who's not doesn't know anything about the field. Uh, but he had GSP on. George St. Pierre, one of the greatest martial artists. I'm a huge fan of him. You know, I love martial arts. I love the respectfulness in, in nature and the intelligence of GSP. You know, George, he's a, not only a smart, a smart fighter, but he's a very, you know, dedicated martial artist and just a... You know, just an example to everyone. And when I saw this video, it's this called the carnivore diet. Uh, George C. Pierre did a carnivore diet and he only ate one meal a day. And how he felt great. And it's just like, God, it's so it's so annoying to see such great martial artists get influenced by Joe Rogan and his bullshit. And Joe Rogan got influenced by this guy called Dr. Sean Baker, who's a big bullshitter on the internet who's basically taking steroids and saying he's a world-setting athlete record. He's setting all these records. And by the way, he also lost his license. He's not a doctor anymore. He's a to he's a, just a, another scam bag on the internet promoting a fad diet, making a quick buck of, of noobs. The thing is, the thing about the carnivore diet is, is one, if you open up a biology book, one thing you'll know in the biology book, it's basic common knowledge. Humans are primates. And what, what, what primates, like chimpanzees, orangutans, gorillas, and what do those animals eat primarily? Because humans are also animals. 95%, uh, I think gorillas, maybe orangutans, 98% of calories come from plants. Well, plant eaters. And it's this, and then another another thing is one meal a day. It's like you, we're not we're not a snake, you know. We're not snakes. We're not lions. <laughs> it's so stupid and ridiculous. With, with Lex saying stuff like on this video, like, oh, you know, I eat I eat I eat carbohydrates and then I feel lazy. Well, I don't know what kind of carbohydrates are you eating. You must be eating Snicker bars and, and the carbohydrates that are full of fat. I, I like start you know starches sure make you tired but I don't eat starches in the morning you know I predominantly eat fruit and vegetables and well, smoothies and stuff and fruit juices in the morning to have high energy to get shit done it's I, it's so bizarre that the video is just and just everyone like it's so strange everyone saying oh like man, what the fucking look at that acne from all this cycling Jesus Christ the helmet acne, they call it. Um, th just this ridiculous, oh, you know, it's so annoying eating food. It just takes away so much time. It's like, what? And that's why everyone was on caffeine and all these ridiculous stimulants. Like, you need food for energy. And if you look at, if you look at, uh, ca like, cows or, like, a lot of herbivores or, like, gorillas, like, 90% of the time they just rest and relax and eat food and chew their food slowly, you know? Most people don't even chew, f chew food enough properly, you know? That's why they have, like, constipation, because they, like, they don't break up the food properly. It, it's so ridiculous, you know? Carnival diets just, it doesn't make any sense. We're not carnivores, you know? A real carnivore will eat the whole animal. First of all, the carnivore has big teeth and claws and it can go out with its body, without any tools, hunt the animal. It has the skills and it has the ability to hunt the animal, bite into it, kill it, and eat. start eating the whole thing. Chew on the bone, everything. The skin, the fur, everything. You know? And humans, oh, people always just need a little piece of this, piece of that, like, convenient pieces. You know, it's like, you're not a carnival, bro. And it's such a shame to see George, you know, fall into these fad diets. You know, you think someone is really smart and intelligent, but you do these stupid fads because Joe Rogan said so. Just fucking, just, guys, honestly, Joe Rogan has nothing. He has no idea about good nutrition, zero, you know? 
the guy, first of all, in the beginning of his career, took steroids and, and, and testosterone and got big, and he still takes stimulants and all sorts of weird shit. Who knows what he's taking, you know? Smoking, drinking, you know, all you are athletes out there, martial artists and people into fitness, don't take George's, uh, don't take Joe Rogan's advice at all, all right? And it's a shame to see George, such an incredible fighter, do this stupid bullshit fad. You know, all it is is a fad. Long term, he might feel good. He might feel good at the start doing this diet. But long term, it's going to fuck up your health. It's not. It's going to be nothing but damage, nothing but problems. Long term for your health. It's unsustainable long term. I'm talking about 10, 15 years I mean, you're going to have testicular cancer and, and all sorts of other issues if you could keep doing that. Look what happened to Furious Beat. You know, he was eating ridiculous amounts of food, animal products, a ridiculous fast pace. He got testicular cancer twice. Dos. All right. So don't don't be get don't don't be a fool and don't get scammed on the internet. Not a scam, but don't don't get sucked in into these fat diets. Animal products, and especially me, all it does is takes away energy from you, all right? Because our intestines are not designed to, to process the stuff. A, 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 a lion's long intestine is a lot shorter than humans. So it's just, it's just not... It, our body has to work harder to just break that stuff down, you know? And it's acidic as well. Like, just, no. All right, long term, you're going to feel shit. And you're going to have some serious health problems. So don't be an idiot. Don't do the carnivore diet. I don't know. I've done so many videos. I've done three, four videos about this. Because people just keep cropping up on the internet. And just it just pisses me off. And not only that, it's, just, it's dangerous to promote this kind of stuff on the internet. It's dangerous. Even mainstream doctors like, I don't know, what? It doesn't make sense. You need, first of all, you need fiber in your diet. Just, just no. No. Okay? Don't be an idiot.